Hello YouTube, it's me again. I did get a nice package from Elder Crow today. And you wonder why it's this big? Well, I have stencils in it. And let me see how I'm gonna open this. Where I'm gonna open it. I had one order before, I did order one before stencil and but it was <laughs> look at that it looks just awesome it's MDF with all holes in them <laughs> great I like that okay this just seems to be a cover so it won't get damaged I really like how this looks. Look at that. It's like a piece of art. Hmm. That's what they use as a bottom when they are drilling and milling the PCBs. Wow. Nice. Maybe useless but nice. Let's see. Could be that I'm out of the picture because this thing is just so huge. Okay. Oh, where am I? Wow. Just a second, let me take this stuff out of here. Wow, look at that. Can you see this? It is a stencil in a frame. I guess this is how it looks like when it's in a frame. Okay, let me show you real quick. This is the stencil I got before without the frame. So if you order it without the frame, this is what it looks like. And if you do order it with a frame, this is what you get. Wow. When you're not using it, you can hang it on the wall. Put backlight behind it and enjoy your, enjoy your work anyhow so if anybody is wondering how a framed stencil looks like I can't even fit it in the screen here it's too big this is how it looks like and this is aluminum and it's well unreal oh okay let's see I am in the picture. Okay, it does say the model number. I even have some Chinese writing on it. Wow, I like this. 30 by 40 centimeters. And I got a barcode. And I supplied just a single PCB Gerber file and they sent me today the Gerber file they make when they penalize it. And I like this. It's really nice. Thank you David very much for sending me the stencil. And let's see my new PCBs. And 
and this is my latest version. It now has a SMA connector pads for my GSM alarms that I make and it has my logo you can hardly see it I think it has my logo now cube with my initials and this looks very very nice I have to look at it with my magnifying, magnifying glass Oh, you can even see it here, see? So... This is very nice, actually. The silk screen is much better than the previous ones. Well, we had a few problems the last two orders, so... This is the fixed version. And this really looks nice. I'm sorry, my magnifying glass is dirty too. So here we go again. Um, I'm not putting version numbers no more because I don't know how many different versions I already had this is actually I think the third or fourth version but I'm constantly working on it and I'm not counting those now from now on I'm gonna just put the month and the year so I know when I did it and obviously the newer this the later the version is anyhow this is really nice and this is with uh, v-grooving penalized with v-grooves so you can just break them apart and I show you the other ones I have and this is the milled version With this one, after you break it up, you can clean the edges. It's smooth, but you still see the drill holes, the edges of the drill holes. And with this, I cannot make my uh, double, triple, or four, or six, or nine, all at custom gauges. So this was not supposed to be like this, and I got these in as a replacement. So anyhow, I also am getting into OBD2 displays now. I have some parts ordered and I will have most likely the world's smallest OBD2 gauge, CAN bus gauge for your car or newer motorcycles. And then you have just two wi uh, four wires to connect to the car just plus minus and can high and can low and it will be hot pluggable via the OBD2 port and you can either do it yourself or when ordering choose which gauges you want what you want to have shown and everything but that that will come anyhow I'm getting low on memory again on my phone so this is the stencil and these are my new PCBs. If anybody's interested, I'm sure you know how to find me. Thanks for watching and take care.